So our next D is for dilators, like vasodilators, like nitroglycerin, commonly given for chest pain, but it also works in heart failure patients to lower the blood pressure. So remember the O's here. Think diolators like nitro. They open up the blood vessels to decrease the blood pressure by dilating the vessels and decreasing resistance. In fancier terms, it helps lower preload and afterload, which lowers the blood pressure. This results with more oxygen out to the body. Kind of like taking your thumb off a water hose, you relieve the pressure, and all that tension in the tube is suddenly decreased. In the same way, wider dilated blood vessels means less constriction and less pressure, or low blood pressure. Now again, our famous vasodilator is nitroglycerin. So think nitro makes the blood pressure low, or gives O2 to the heart muscle. Or just think nitro is like a pillow for the heart, rested and relaxed, decreased blood pressure. Now the top five names on the NCLEX are nitroglycerin, nitroprusside, hydrolyzine, here's a tricky one, isosobride, which is so, so tricky. Guys, write this down. It ends in ide and sounds so, so familiar to furosemide, the diuretic. So very simply, remember the O's in isosobride means it's a vasodilator similar to nitro. Guys, lots of O's. And the last one here is minoxidil. Now, we only saw that one time out of 10,000 NCLEX questions we took, so it's not really common on the NCLEX. Now, the killer precautions. The number one thing that shows up on the NCLEX and nursing tests is no Viagra. Drugs ending in AFIL, like zildenafil. Guys, it will kill. We're talking extremely low blood pressure. So our memory trick for AFIL is Viagra. It AFILs a certain male anatomy. Or AFIL will kill. And speaking of low blood pressure, our two key numbers here. We stop nitro if the systolic blood pressure, the number on top, is below 90 or 100, or if we see drops by 30 points or more. And NCLEX keywords like confusion, agitation, even cold or pale or clammy, known as diaphoretic or dizzy, guys, these are all early signs of low blood pressure, that hypotension. So we always monitor that blood pressure with nitro. Now, normal side effects are always the three H's usually always present after the very first dose. So headaches or hypotension, also called our orthostatic hypotension, and hot flushing or facial redness. Now this is not an allergic reaction, these are common and normal. So teach patients slow position changes to avoid that dizziness and falling, again called that orthostatic hypotension, and always check the BP before giving this drug. Now for the top seven NCLEX tips on nitro, we're talking patch versus pill for angina patients. Guys, we cover that in our angina chest pain videos. So if you're watching that here on the membership site, you can find it under angina in the MI section. Thanks to our team of experts helping us make these great videos. All right, guys, see you next time.